Ted Bishop, how how is he? How is he looking like he could be okay for tomorrow? I think he's fifty fifty. I think he's um he's a little bit sore in the area. I don't think it's um isolated in terms of you know completely or definitely the issue that he had going into the game um, or building into the game. So we'll have a, we'll know a little bit more this morning because obviously straight away after the game, sort of during the game, he was on the anti-inflammatories and obviously he stopped taking them uh, yesterday just to make sure obviously you get a clear indication of um, you know if there's going to be swelling, if there's going to be pain. Um, so yeah, I'll have a little bit more sort of news. Um, hopefully a little bit late this morning once uh, he gets proper assessed. How much more of a satisfying Sunday was it compared to the, the last few previous ones you've had? Yeah, I mean, it was. I mean, obviously, um, I think certainly the, the, the biggest disappointment <coughs> this season, I suppose, has been, has been the Oxford game. Um, well, there's a lot of factors that <coughs> sort of contributed to that in terms of one of them was obviously having to play without a striker, which never helps. Um, but I think I've said all along quite consistently, you know, um, we're not a million miles away of it, but I think the way we sort of started the game and then continued to sort of progress throughout the game on Saturday was really, really pleasing. So, yeah, um, it's nice to win games where they become comfortable and you win a game 5-1, um, you know, but... Winning 1-0, I would have been just as satisfied and yeah, my Sunday would have been just as nice.